Hello everyone. Welcome back to my channel. I know it's been a while that I've been gone, but I've been super duper busy for the past few weeks and um, I've been doing a lot of errands, so is why I wasn't able to like go live or um, a blow up video. But yeah, so welcome back and whoever doesn't know me, my name is Raisa Ureña and I'll be speaking, I'll be talking about Mary Kay products. Um, it's my first time trying on Mary Kay products and I'm very excited to share this great opportunity with everyone else. Uh, yeah, so let's start by showing you, I'm sorry guys, my light is too bright. Um, There we go. Much better. Um, can see me a little better. It was too. Uh, it was a little too bright. <laughs> so, oh, this bag is so heavy. So I'm gonna be showing you. Um, like I said, um, I'm going to be sharing this great opportunity with you guys. I'm going to be showing you guys um, what stuff I have from Mary, Mary Kay Ash. Um, this beautiful, nice kit bag that I got with them. I'm very excited. I can't wait to show what I use. And what, like, you know, what I do my makeup with and stuff like that. So, so let's talk about um, this beautiful. Um, Time wise repair revealing radiance facial peel. So it's like it's like a mask that you put it you put on and you leave it for a couple of minutes and just follow the instructions and whatever it tells you to do. And um, it's supposed to give you radiance in your face, like like you know, have you know, don't have like wrinkles and things like that. Um, it's supposed to help with um, blemishes, things like that. It's supposed to help with a lot of dead skin cells on the skin. So this peels off most of the dead skin cells. This is really amazing. I, I recommend this. So, yes. But before we even talk about products... Let's talk about makeup, Mary Kay's makeup. Um, I love their makeup. I tried it on for the first time, and it's amazing. I like how the makeup stays on throughout the whole day, and it actually helps me <clears throat> not sweat the makeup off. Like, they also have... Um, set spray so that's very like important because you don't have to like retouch your makeup you could just set um put the, the set spray on your make on your face and your makeup will stay on for the rest of the day <clears throat> let's talk about um the trends the translucent loose powder. 
this thing right here is so cool. Like, I use this for, like, a lot of things. Um, I use it for, like, if I'm going to contour my face, um, I can use the white powder to make certain parts of my face lighter and, or, you know, to make certain parts darker and help the contour pop out a little more. Um, yeah, I'm trying to open it here, but it's kind of difficult to open it. <laughs> and voila. Wow, this is gorge. Look at this, guys. Mary Kay, this is gorgeous. Gorge, gorge, gorge. I love it because um, you can you can use this as much as you want, and it will still last you for like maybe a couple of months or more or depending how much you use it. And it also like has a protection. <laughs> like it, it's so cool. So see how you heard that snap? So you snap open and you close. So the powder won't come up. But it's like a white powder, so of course I'm sure that everyone knows about the white powder and how good it can make your contour look while you're contouring your face. I love it personally, but um, reading about it a little bit, it says, This invisibly sheer powder helps control excess oil while setting makeup for a flawless look on any skin tone. Brush on lightly over foundation for a skin perfecting finish. Wow, this is amazing. Like, this will actually make your skin look more like radiant. Like, it's just, I'm actually wearing it right now. I don't know if you guys can tell, but this is a little dark. So yeah, I'll, I, personally like love it um i just like how it makes my skin look i think it's amazing it also says um is dermatologist tested suitable for sensitive skin oil and fragrance free non comet comet Homogenic, something like that. Never heard of that word, but it sounds really interesting. That's actually really, really good. Um, I'm glad that you know it's oil free and it doesn't like contain any of that stuff. I don't need extra oils in my skin whatsoever. My skin is dry, but I don't, I don't like, um, when it's like too much oil, it doesn't feel right. Yeah. This is amazing. I love this. Oh, I think I know why it's so dark. Give me one second, guys. I may have to turn on the light on this because it's getting really, really dark.
Um, I'm sorry, guys. I'll be right there. Just give me one second. There we go, and um, I got it to look lighter, which is better. Now you guys can see me better. Um, everything I show on the camera. Okay, so next I'm gonna be showing you guys. Um, You know what? The Time Wise Matted Wear Liquid Foundation. So I love this foundation. This foundation is amazing. I don't know if you guys can see that. I love this foundation. Um, like I said before, I don't wear liquid foundations, but for so far, so good. Um, this one don't contain drop facts. So I think that's why it doesn't harm my skin in any way. Um, whoa. I'm sorry guys, I'm having too much interruptions. Sorry guys, my laptop was about to turn off, so... I had to um, put it on the charger. Um, yeah, so I remember I mentioned before that I can't use um, liquid foundations because some liquid foundations do contain drug facts, and obviously this one don't contain drug facts, as you can see. It tells you the type of ingredients it has, but um, I'm very, very, very in love with this foundation because I can use it and it doesn't like let me have like um, like little dots or red spots in my face. Um, I actually love it. So this is called the Time Wise. Matted Wear Liquid Foundation from Mary Kay. And, um, yeah, it's, and it's, a uh, bronze two, is a, is a two, which is, it's perfect for my skin tone. It's not too dark, not too light. Um, it's in between, it's just right. Um, and it's a matted wear liquid foundation, by the way, guys. Ingredients, it has agua, cellophane, cellophane, something like that, it's weird ingredients. Tassiloxano, ultilingical, demitaciona, trimtils, loxis, lox, Gato, some weird words. Cross Palmero de la Rue, 
is like uh, I guess Latin. Um. Okay, this is the other one. I didn't see this one here. Sorry, guys. This is the English and Spanish version. Um, it contains water, uh, luxane, butylene, glyco, dimethicone, trimethicyline, oxalate. Whoa, lauricyl, methacrylate. Glyco, dimethyclate, cross polymer. It contains a lot of weird um, ingredients in this one little bottle of matted wear, I mean, matted liquid foundation. I don't understand. Whoa. All I can say is that I love it. Um, I love it. It's amazing. Um, I'm glad it doesn't have no drug fat. There are some products that contain drug facts that I cannot use in Mary Kay products. Um, but like primer, I did try the primer and luckily it didn't do anything to my skin. So I was really lucky. And um, I'm really proud of my skin for not failing me this time. <laughs> that means like I could wear it and um, I can protect my skin um, from makeup or pimples or anything like that. Um, I'm very excited. Um, right now, my makeup, it's done by Mary Kay. So um, my brows came out perfect. I just love how they came out. Um, my lashes is from mascara, uh, Mary Kay Mascara. I just love it. It's amazing. Um, honestly, like honestly, I can say that Mary Kay's makeup is one of the best makeup brands in in the United States because I wear makeup and it's like I don't feel the the, the liquid products on my face too much like I, I know I'm wearing makeup but I can't feel it too much so basically saying it doesn't bother me it, it, I don't really feel it like it's just amazing it feels i feel like i feel good about it like i could say i could actually forget and say i'm not wearing any makeup or anything like that um but i know i'm wearing makeup but if like i'm outside or whatever feels like i'm not because it doesn't like you can't nearly feel the makeup on your face like it just it doesn't feel cakey. Like, I don't know if you ever try Max makeup and their makeup feels cakey for some reason. Um, it, like, it, how I explain it, like, Max makeup feels cakey, Mary Kay's makeup don't. You you can actually feel the makeup on your face when you wear makeup, uh, Max products, Max makeup. Mary Kay don't. So that's the amazing thing about Mary Kay, and I love that. So I don't I don't like feeling all like if I'm wearing a whole bunch of makeup in my face, and you know it feels amazing. Another thing about Mary Kay's makeup is that when you're actually wearing the makeup, it doesn't feel like like you're using too much of it because it's so perfect it just covers up everything in one shot you don't have to like reuse the powder or the liquid foundation to get to where you need to like how you want your makeup to come out like it doesn't feel like that like it feels like the when you wear that foundation that one touch that's all you need and your makeup lasts for a long time so 
I'm glad I was able to, I'm glad I decided to try Mary Kay products and I'm really excited about this opportunity and I'll be making more videos and showing you um, how I do my makeup with Mary Kay products, what I use and what how I take care of my face using Mary Kay makeup products. Sorry, Mary, Mary Kay products to take care of my skin before using any makeup. Um, yeah. Yeah, so. I love it. I, I just, I love it. Oh, sorry guys, I'm eating um, yogurt. I love yogurt. <laughs> That's something that I also would like to talk about in my next video. Yogurt is very, very important, guys. So I'm gonna, making, I'm gonna be making a video about yogurt very soon, and I hope you guys enjoy that video um i hope it helps you guys a lot especially females it's very important to yogurt so i eat it all the time um it's something that i that i love to do i love eating yogurt it's healthy for you yeah so i'll be making a video about yogurt so you guys can see why i always eat it i try to eat it almost every day um uh, it's that important <laughs> Um, let's move on with, um, Mary Kay's gel liners. Um, I love Mary Kay gel liners, um, especially gel liners because they're, um, waterproof and they come in different colors and you can just easily manage your your eyeliner however you want to do it um you could do the eyeliner you can do the cat eye look you could do whatever you want this is amazing i love this um gel liner right here um it says mary Kay as well um the one that i have is color purple as you can see, it's gorgeous. Um, I'm wearing it right now. I don't know if you guys can tell. Um, like I said before, I always change my hairstyles. So um, I went from short to long. I like to wear my hair extensions. And um, I did mention in a few of my videos that I like to, you know, create hair for fun and um, change my hairstyles all the time. It's very important to change hairstyles so you won't get bored of the same hairstyles. But I do like, um, I, like I picked the purple gel liner because um, I've been wearing um, green lately, so purple and green looks gorgeous together. I love it. And um, yes, but that's the reason why um, I like the gel liners because you can do much more than regular um, pencil liners. Um, you can wear as you can do your eye cat look. You can wear it as eyeliner. You can do anything with it. Um, and this is the color, um, which is purple, but they call it ornate orchid, which is weird. <laughs> And um, it says it has directions in the ingredients, what it contains, um, directions, precise application, dip expendable brush into liner and glide across 
lash shine from inner to outer corner. Warning. In case of eye irritancy, infection, or scratches, discontinue use of all eye cosmetic products and consult a physician. Mo diplo the employee. This is a different language, guys. I'm sorry. Um, yeah, so it's very important to when you're actually using the gel liner, um, it doesn't get in your eye because it can cause any irritation or anything like that um but i always like i said i like to use it so i be very careful when i'm doing my when i'm using this beautiful mary Kay pen i mean um brush i think it's gorgeous it's this big and um, you just slide it on like a set of directions to, um, you know, start applying it on your eye, on your lower waterline. I, I, I personally love this. Like, I just love it. Now you can see a little more of it because I didn't use the whole thing. I left some gel liner on the on the brush and I forgot to clean it. So I'm just like using the excess to make my cat eye look long. I don't know, just something. I love this. Um, I think this is one of the best um, brushes they invented for to use for gel liners. It's very convenient. It's small. You can take it with you anywhere. Um, you can make it feel make it look longer by just changing the top to the top of the of the brush and having like a better grip on it. Like I just love it. Like it's it's awesome. Um, it's very convenient to use. Very. Now I'm just, um, <laughs> I'm playing, so, um, yeah. I love, um, little crazy things, so. I like doing different um, designs. I'll be showing you guys in my next video um, different type of makeup looks, like eye makeup looks, and um, I'll be showing you how to get uh, a makeup cat, cat eye look, cat look for Halloween. I'll be doing a video on that very soon for Halloween. Um, can't wait. And I'll be showing you guys how I do that with the Mary Kay makeup products. Um, yeah, so Let's move on to Mary Kay's Mineral Cheek Color Duo little palette. It's like a little small palette. I love it. Um, it's amazing. It's very easy to carry if you want to carry it with you. It's very convenient. Um, I personally, personally use this. I use this for my cheeks. Of course, it's supposed to be for your cheeks, but I use it for my eyelids as well. Um, I do that because I think, you know, it, you know, it's cool to do. Um, I think it's okay to use it for your eyelids as well. Um, I don't like too much make eye makeup, so... 
If I do do eye makeup, I use these type of colors. It's not too strong. Oops, it fell. <laughs> um, it's not too strong, but um, I'll be doing makeup, eye makeup tutorials very soon. Um, using Mary Kay makeup products. Um, this one, like I said, is very convenient. Um, it has two different two different shades. Um. It has like a light pink, and it's like a the, the other one is like a like a glowish shimmer color. It's like a like a cream nude. It doesn't say it on the top, but it's just so pretty. I love it. I'm in love with that color. You guys can see. It's gorgeous. I love it. <laughs> I'm actually wearing it right now on my the pink one on my upper cheek. Um ingredients. Ingredients. It has capric trilla trillis right? Cilia silica. So weird, weird names. Well, I can't pronounce these names because it's so weird. Like, I mean, these words, like, it's just so weird. Does it say anything else? Um, so supposedly the colors of these two shades is ripe watermelon and pastique more. I guess this is one is the watermelon, this is the pastel one. But it's, it's, it's gorgeous. I love it. I love it. Uh, we also have um, Mary Kay brushes. Mary Kay brushes, guys. I'm in love with their brushes. Like, it's gorgeous. I I love how they feel. The feeling of it is so soft, and I just I'm in love. So here we have four Mary Kay makeup brushes. They're kind of dirty because yeah, I've been I just started using them. I will be I will definitely clean them very soon. But this one here, this one is my favorite one. I love this one. This one actually helps me tap on my skin, like tap, tap. Like, oh my God, I love how it feels. Um, it helps me um, do whatever I wanna do with it, whatever I feel comfortable doing with this one. Um, but most, I use this one most to tap on the powder or the white powder. Um, and it's from Mary Kay, like I said. It's gorgeous. And then it says liquid foundation. You can also use this one for your liquid foundation as well. Um... This one is for the eye crease. This one right here. I love it because it actually helps me get the nice crease up there. And it allows me to get that nice arch on my brows. So yeah, I use this one a lot, a lot. And it's really thin, so I like that it's very thin. It's perfect. Uh, this one is for all over eye shadow. So this one you could use for your eye shadow. And this one also, eye sm smudger. So these are both for the eyes. You can use one for eye shadows. And this one is like for to smudge the eyeliner or to... 
smush the eyeshadow, however you want to use it, move the way, most convenient way you can utilize these two brushes right here. And like I said, these brushes are amazing. I love how they feel. The texture is super soft. Um, yeah. And then we also have the Ivory One. Sheer Mineral Press Powder. So this is the pressed powder. I, I'm in love with this powder, guys. This is the one that I was telling you guys about that I can use this to press on my skin to just dab, 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 dab. Oh my God. Yes, you see that? You saw that? You saw that? Oh my God. Wow. That's just looks amazing just right now like and I only had to do it once I didn't have to do it like a couple of times like I said before you don't have to do it a couple of times these last you for a long time if you do do your makeup every day it will still last you for about like more than six months um you don't have to tap more than three or four times you can tap like two times or so if you feel like you need to um and you you will grab more than what you think and and it's still like lasts you so that's what i like about this little and it's small too so you could take it anywhere you want um and it's just amazing i love this one and the color is ivory one like i said before um let's talk about volumizing brow Tint tinctor. So this one actually you can use this one for your brow to like is is to like like you know go over your brow so it can like if you want to make it darker. Um, they have all different type of colors. They have brunette, they have bronze, they have blonde. They have all different type of colors. So you can use this to volumize the brows. It also says the ingredients it contains in the back. Um, it tells you the color at the top, which is dark brunette. And, um, well, it tells you yes from Mary Kay. Oh, I love this. I used this like once and I like how my eyebrows look like right now. Mary Kay products is legit. Uh, let's talk about mascara. They have such pretty mascara. This is mascara um, that I like a lot from them. It's called Mary Kay's Love Amore Lash Love Mascara. It's, um, I love black, which is a color black. And like I said, it's called Lash Love Mascara. And it can, like it tells you the ingredients in the back and what it contains. It does not contain drug facts, so that's excellent. Um, once again, that's very, very good. It doesn't contain drug facts. Um, it does make your lashes look really, really long. Uh, it does give it a lot of volume. Um, I like how my lashes comes out a little more, like the way it pops out. Um, I just love this mascara. It's amazing. Um, let me show you guys how it looks. This is how it looks. It's pretty. They have like a really pretty art around the the mascara. It's gorgeous. Um, and this is how it looks. 
Give you a quick demonstration. I just love it feels so good too like it doesn't hurt your lashes even if it's dry and it, like it doesn't hurt like it re moist moistens the lashes Tell you, Mary Kay products are legit. I love it. I, I, I just, I love it. It feels really, it moistens up the, the mascara again. The, I used some mascaras before that I would try to use it on top of the, the dry one. And um, it was kind of hard because it hurt my lashes and my skin like my my waterline but for some reason this one is so moist that it actually makes it remoistens the the lash to recapture the the mascara over again that's that's pretty cool you know so i love this mascara it's like one of the best mascaras and um if it's waterproof, no, it's not waterproof, but Mary Kay does sell waterproof mascaras and all different types of volume brushes and all that stuff. Um, uh, let's talk about two more. Um, makeup um, perfect uh, concealer that I've, I've been having in mind to share with you guys. Um, so this is the perfecting concealer and um, it's like a little dark. It's not too dark, but it's like you can use it for like contour or um, if you're darker than you're darker you can use it as of you can have this color and you know use it as a contour or um to do your eyebrows whatever you want to do um i use this one because i like to contour so i use it to contour my face but not my brows um it is darker than my actual skin complexion so i love this one this one is amazing um Uh, so it's like a corrector perfecting concealer, dismissulator perfecting concealer, and perfecting concealer. So it does three different things. Uh, the color is a bronze, bronze, deep bronze. There we go. That's, that's the one I was looking for. <laughs> Can I find it at first? Um, yeah, and it's from, it's by Mary Kay, and, um, yeah, this is, like, amazing. I love this, and it's, like, uh, the, 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 it's, like, a wand, yeah, it's, like, a wand, so it's, like, it's easier, really, really convenient to use on your face. You don't have to, like, do, like, this, or, it's very convenient, I like that. And it lasts you because you take out, take in, take out. You don't have to be like swiping off, swiping off. Like there's some um, concealer products that you gotta be swiping off, and like you use them, you use way too much than what you usually use. Um, but the one, the one with the one is actually really good because it doesn't let you take out too much. That's what I like about it. Yeah, and um, lastly, oh my god, I love it. 
I love Mary Kay lipstick. It's gorgeous. Like the color that I also wanted to have was this brown, light brown lipstick from Mary Kay. Um, it's called a uh, rich truffle color, and. Yeah, um, he has a rich truffle color. It's like a, it's not a brown, but it's like a light, light brown. So let me show you guys. I have lipstick on, but this one is darker than just the one that I have on. So I'm going to show you guys how this one looks. So I like to use like that. <laughs> This is also nice. So you can see my color, the lips of my color changed to a darker um, truffle, rich truffle color. Uh, it's like, it was more like a, not a dark brown, but it's like in between. Uh, it's not too dark, not too light. So it's just perfect. It's like almost like a nude. And then again, it's not a nude, but um, it's gorgeous. I like it. I like how it looks. Um, everything's perfect about this lipstick. And um, it's rich in minerals. Um, keeps your lips really, really moist, um, doesn't dry your lips or anything like that. So this lipstick is very, very, um, very important. I mean, like, it's good for your lips. It makes, it keeps your lips moisturized. So that's actually really, really good. So that's all that I wanted to share with you guys today. Um... That's my first time, excuse me guys, experiencing <clears throat> Mary Kay products and um, using their makeup and their cleaning uh, products, like, you know, to protect your skin before using any uh, makeups and stuff like that. Uh, I'm in love with their products. I love it. It's amazing. Um, yeah, so, right, <sighs> um, anything else that, um, any update that I will get on Mary Kay products, I will be sharing that with you guys as well, and hopefully, uh, you guys were able to enjoy this video and um, don't forget to like comment and subscribe to my channel um, I will appreciate that and um, my Facebook Instagram and my Gmail is written down below in the description box um, if you guys ever need any questions or um, if you guys want me to make a, another video about um, talking about healthy foods or talking about, you know, life stuff or um, yo or yogurt, like I was just saying earlier today in my video, let me know and I will make a video about it. And if you guys want to know more about Mary Kay, I will be glad to make another video um, doing uh, my makeup and showing you guys what I use before putting on Mary Kay's makeup products. Yeah, so... Um, I will be very appreciated of you guys. If you guys put a thumbs up, thumbs down, it doesn't matter. I will appreciate the support. And like I said, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And I hope you guys can enjoy this beautiful, beautiful evening, even though it's raining outside. 
and um yeah so <laughs> well it's raining over here yes of course but um anywhere else or worldwide i hope you guys enjoyed this video and um see you guys soon and uh yeah i was very very happy to share this with you guys and um i'll be seeing you guys in my next video have a wonderful 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 night bye